our data tell us is several in a million. So you say, oh, not worry about that. But there are people who buy lottery tickets with worse odds than that expecting to win. <laughs> so at some point you gotta sit down and pay attention, even if it's several in a million. So if it threads the center of the keyhole, it'll hit Santa Monica, sorry, it'll hit 500 kilometers west of Santa Monica, plunge into the ocean to a depth of three miles, cavitating the ocean to a width of three miles, it'll explode, that's the cavitating force, and send a tsunami 50, um, 50 to uh, five stories, so 50, 50 feet tsunami, five story tall, that will come to the west coast of North America and basically wipe it clean. Okay, And so this hole in the ocean is what made the first tsunami, but then there's the matter of the hole in the ocean. If you're an ocean and you have a big hole, what is the first thing you're going to do? You want to fill in the hole. So your water fills in the hole, and the act of doing so splashes into the center with such ferocity that it rises high, falls back down, cavitating the ocean again. This will happen about 40 times before it dampens out uh, uh, completely. And so th that means there are about 40 tsunamis that'll come into the coast. And so they'll come in, it'll go through the million dollar Malibu homes, then the next tsunami say, I need your water please. So then the water goes back out, it takes the home with it, you know? And then the next tsunami comes and brings the home back <laughs> in a slightly different shape, right? <laughs> right? And this continues and all this, what we would call civilization on the coast becomes an ablative, churning, destructive force that wipes the entire west coast of the United States clean. Nobody has to die. We would know when this would happen to the minute. Two people will die. The stupid surfer, okay? <laughs> that, that guy is gonna da die, okay? First, uh, okay, ready for the second person? The stupid weatherman, okay? You ever see these guys? Bring the camera a little closer. You can see the waves. The people who want to get close to the hurricanes, those weather guys, that's the second person who dies. 